I just want to know if you're going to be able to get Bobo to come in for some of that free hand carpeted whiskey. That's a great idea. Like, I don't know, Bobo, Bobo's living the fuck. Fucking- just make sure that Dolores doesn't show up. Uh, well, you know, that's up to Steve. But uh, Bobo is living the life. I don't know if we can get... And it keeps falling out. I hate that. I don't know if we can... Sorry, that looked gross. It was just a tea bag. I swear to God. Um, I don't know that we can get Bobo. He's busy living, you know? I believe it's called The Life of Baba O'Reilly. You know? Steve, aren't you the aren't you the Bobo Whisperer? Or you just do the voices? I, I just do uh, the voice. Maybe we'll have Mr. Maloonigan Skype in if we can't get the actual Bobo. What do you, you think? Should, you should DM him and be like, well, hey, Bobo, we're having McCluskey's whiskey and we'd like to have you on the show. I will DM him. Yeah. Does See, anyone have his number? Garrett, you're, you're a big, uh, big wheel here. You have Bobo's phone number, Garrett? Do I have Bobo's phone number? I think so. Come on. Yeah, Jeff. Garrett's sitting on a gold mine. <laughs> Bobo right, Daniel right. Perlin? What's that? Yeah, that one. Yeah. The one, the only. Yeah. Watch it now. Later. Love you, Jeff. By the way, got to tell you, while we're doing that, um, this is apparently a big deal. They're loving the, uh, although I'm sure it's just fans. I'm sure whenever someone puts out a hot sauce. Oh, again, I had nothing to do with this other than telling Jeff of Silk City Hot Sauce. We have the same birthday. And what he made is fucking fantastic. It's endorsed by Little Lemmy. Uh, all right, can we call him on this line or should we get another caller? I'm calling him right now. All right. Are you calling him on our phone? Should we call Briggs? <laughs> Hold on. He's dialing. <laughs> he's styling, dialing, profiling. Gene, you're wiling. Oh, my God. That's much better. My fucking throat. And, yeah, I, I honestly think that's another thing that happens to me every year. My voice goes so I can just look at people and be like, I'm done. Here we go. <laughs> Jeff, ask and ye shall receive. Hello? 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 Bobo. Who? Oh, I'm sorry. Is Bobo there? Is Daniel there? Uh, yes. Who's calling? Tell him it's Gino from In Hot Water. Uh, okay. Hi, Gino. How are you? Very well. How are you? Okay. How's everything going? How was your holiday? It was a lot of fun. I got to hang out with uh, my family, with the uh, wife's family. It was a great time. And uh, just, you know, it's uh, my birthday is on the 29th. So it's just a great oh. time of year for me. Oh, happy birthday. Well, oh, and happy new year to you, Mama Curlin. Okay, stay, stay safe. I'll get you Daniel. All right, thank you. Daniel! Is it any reason they call me, any wonder they call me Eddie Haskell? <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, some guy named, um, some... Biscuit or something is on the phone. <laughs> she Some guy named Biscuit Visconti or something is on the phone. Yeah. Didn't she talk to me for ten minutes like she knew who I was? <laughs> yeah, hello. Yo, Bobo. Yeah. <laughs> Can I get a little more enthusiasm, buddy? It's Gino. Oh, oh all right. All right, no problem. I, I, was, I was, I was, I was, just a little drowsy right now. That's all. Did we wake it's, you, Bobo? No, nah, I just I just took a Benadryl suggestion. <laughs> Can I ask? Are you okay? Why'd you take a Benadryl, Bobo? Sneezing conge- congestion. That's why. <laughs> Jeff, send Jeff, get Jeff's address and send him a, bo- a bottle of wine. <laughs> all right, here's my question, Bobo. First of all, congrats, Giants, big win. You gotta love Terod Taylor. Am I right? Yeah. What did you think of the whole uh, Vinny Cutlets thing? Oh no! I just I, just, I I have a lot of respect for the guy. That guy. How much Benadryl did you take, Bobo? Two. <laughs> I love this kid. All right. I took I took two of them. <laughs> because you were sneezing. Yeah, exactly. Sne- sneezing like crazy. <laughs> okay, but are you just because it's a- <laughs> do you have allergies, Bobo? Yeah. <laughs> These are not hard questions. These are, what are you allergic to, you think? Mr. Maloonigan, God forbid? No. No. I, no, I was just, a, I was just, it, 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 was, it was just more of a cold that I had. How come we don't have a picture of Bobo? What are we doing? We, <laughs> I'm kidding. You guys work here. All right. Here's my question, Bobo. Um, who do you think the Giants, uh, do you think the Giants draft a quarterback? 
I believe they are going to draft a quarterback. Do you realize, uh, but they don't have a very, where do they pick in the draft? Do you know? And um, they, they, they officially, they're, they're sixth in the draft. You know who picks right before them? Yeah, I heard your Chargers pick before for them. Because we have the we because we took forever to fire our fucking head coach. That's what I'm allergic to. Uh, you know what I'm allergic to, Bobo? Mediocrity. What? That's why I haven't sneezed once talking to you, champ. I feel like I'm trying to sell him fucking his stock. Now I'm sitting on something that you're the first one I called, Bobo. You're the first one I called. Now do you recall? Do you recall the time you did an ad for what I believe was um. When you did an ad for, I believe it was McCluskey's hand carved whiskey. Do you remember that? Yes, I do. Uh, well, I'll tell you who else does the fans, and they think you're a goddamn think you're a goddamn star. Now, we uh, one fan enjoyed it so much uh, that he uh, one fan enjoyed the <laughs> one fan enjoyed it so much, buddy, that he um, literally what the fuck continue without storage um, that he literally. Is making uh he's he's making commemorative hand carved whiskeys and such. Isn't that fantastic? Yeah, that is fantastic. I'm, I got to pick up a bottle or two for myself. Well, suppose I told you there are only two bottles that he made. Um. Oh, so- oh wow. <laughs> he's taking a break, Bobo. No, no, you're gonna. This is gonna be worth it. First of all. I'm, I'm taking a bait. I'm baiting the hook. Well, suppose I told you you could enjoy uh, from these two bottles, which we, we, me, Garrett, Steve, and everyone here in In Hot Water will be the first to admit. Uh, I just sent it under vid. We'll be the first to admit this wouldn't exist without you, Bobo. Now, is there any chance that you could come in Thursday and enjoy, sit at the desk with me, fucking come in early? I'm begging you coming early because obviously Steve, Steve would love to have you. I, I, I wouldn't have you on the show half the time if it wasn't for Steve and Bobby. So why don't you, uh, Thursday, uh, where do you live? I, I, I live in Maspeth. I could make it up there. Ooh. Ooh. All right. So here's what you do. We'll you give c- you some bus money or whatever. Yeah, too. I was going to say, we'll Uber them. Is it an expensive Uber? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll take care of your bus if you don't mind, but we'll we'll reimburse you. We'll, we'll make it worth your while, Bobo. But come in Thursday around uh, around 1:30 if you want to sit in on the dump, and I I can assure you the fans would love that. And uh, then we'll and then at uh, two uh, two thirty we'll crack the uh, whiskey. Is that cool? That's cool. All right. Now, also, I didn't mean to brag, but. To celebrate that, I sent a video while I was taking a break to the boys of the moment when the McCluskey's legend was born. Would you like us to play that? Yeah, yeah definitely. Here we go. McCall's. Irish whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, Bubble. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> there you go. The birth of a nation. All right. So we will be enjoying a single batch. Uh, it's uh, it's McCluskey's hand carved with uh, the special name $500 Canadian. Or what was the other one? Doing all right so far? Or is it dueling all right so far? I think it was She's a Nice One. She's, she's a nice. nice One. All right. So we will see you Thursday, Bobo, around 1.30. All right. <laughs> there's, there's, and tell you what, <laughs> tell you what. We'll have some Benadryl for you. Get some rest, buddy, okay? All right. All right, bye. Later, Bobo. Love you, Bobo. All right. We should fly Jeff in to drink with him just for that idea. Jesus Christ. (laughs) I took a... Who's allergic to stuff in the middle of winter after a snowstorm? What is there? There's no pollen in the air. Dust. What is he allergic to? Might be allergic to Mr. Malunigan. (laughs) Never never at three in the afternoon. Well, I took a Benadryl. (laughs) Guy's a goddamn pro.